All right, let's talk about how to nail the first 20 seconds or so of a cold call. It starts with your intent. If your intent is to talk everyone into booking a meeting with you, you're gonna say things and behave in ways that create pressure. And whenever prospects feel the pressure, they're gonna enter the zone of resistance, which is a reflex reaction to sales pressure. So before we pick up the phone, we wanna actually detach from the outcome, let go of expectations or assumptions. Of course, you have a hypothesis as to how you could potentially help your prospect, but you don't know until you actually speak with them. Turns out when you actually make this intent mindset shift, you end up sounding in ways that are more inviting the prospects. So they're more open to having a conversation with you because they don't feel the pressure. So let me share with you the first three parts. This should get you 35, 25, 40 seconds into the call. So prospect picks up and you're gonna say this. Uh, hey Josh, my name is James. We've never spoken before, but I'm working with a couple of podcast creators and I came across your name and was hoping to ask you a couple questions. You got a sec? And pause. So part one is we're gonna extend a mini invitation to ask for someone's permission to talk. What's the psychology here? When people give you permission to talk, they're more likely to hear you out, at least for part two, because people wanna stay congruent with what they said. It feels incongruent or bad if I say I'm gonna do something and then my actions aren't consistent with that. So I have found with the right tonality, about 85 to 90% of the time, using some opener like that, a prospect will say, uh, sure, what's this about? And then we're gonna make sure that we're actually talking to the right person. Uh, despite doing your research, it's possible that the person that you're calling isn't the one responsible for what it is that you're selling. Uh, that might sound like this. Uh, thanks. Hey, Josh, are you still involved with promoting and editing the Inside Selling Podcast? Simple like that. Are you still involved with? Are you still handling? Are you still responsible for? Some phraseology like that to make sure you're in the right place. Uh, yeah, that's me. Uh, how can I help you? And then part three. We're not gonna pitch. What we're simply gonna do is ask a question that shines a light on a potential problem and then we're gonna see if that problem resonates with a prospect without having any ulterior motive. So that might sound like this. So Josh, many of the podcast creators we work with are using two to three different tools like Headliner and Subtitles and Adobe Logic to promote and edit their podcast. How are you currently going about promoting and editing your podcast today? And you're just gonna be quiet. This is for a product called Descript, but you can easily use this framework for your prospects. You're simply trying to understand the current state so that you can see if there's a potential problem you could potentially help with. All right, plug your product or service into this framework and let me know how it sounds for the first 35 to 45 seconds of your call.